everybody, welcome back to my channel, hope you're doing really really well. Um, I recently went to Autumn Towers and on the way home um, I popped into Birmingham and I went into the giant Primark, oh my goodness, it was amazing. Um, and I also popped into a Superdrug as well and before I put all the stuff away I just wanted to show you some of the things I got because I don't know. I just want to. Um, I did try and go in the Disney cafe in the Primark but the queue was quite big and then when I looked like inside it wasn't actually as big as I thought it would be and the food didn't, I don't know, I wasn't really that impressed so I wasn't going to get in the queue. Um, but yeah I'm going to show you what I got so I think I'll start with Primark. I just need to get my receipts out uh, so I can remember prices of things. Right, okay. Let's start with Primark. So, like the biggest thing is this. It's covered in like cellophane, so it's like reflecting. But I saw these and the Primark near me is quite small, I would say. And so there's not really that much stuff in like the beauty section or anything. And I saw these and I couldn't believe it. Well, I could believe it, but <laughs> they were so cool. So these are like drawer organizers um, with like different shaped and size sections in. Um, I have no idea what to use it for. I don't know whether to use it for makeup, but there's some like quite small sections or whether to use it for like jewelry or something. Not sure, but I thought I would buy one and see if I use it. Um, the label says five pounds, but this actually was four pounds. Um, yeah, so that was quite cool. They also had like, um, you know, like the clear acrylic, um, drawers and stuff um, and there I really want some actually that are like long and thin drawers that I can have on the top of my dressing table to free up some space in my drawers um, but they had like big fat ones like this like next to each other um, and yeah, they also they had loads basically that kind of like stack on top of each other and stuff. Um, and I saw a picture of the ones that I wanted, but they weren't there, which is a shame. Um, but yeah, I got I got this. I don't know what. Yeah, I don't know what I'm gonna organise, but I'm gonna organise something. <laughs> um, oh, I bought my sister um, a little thing to go in her birthday like bag. Um, my sister Maisie, when it's her birthday, I tend to just buy things that she'll like like lots of like little things and just like wrap them up in a bag um and I saw this little lip gloss it's bubblegum fragrance and it's in the shape of a diamond and I just feel like she'd like that so she's going to be nine this was one pound there were lots of like unicorn and Minnie Mouse things but I feel like she's turning nine and she's kind of growing out of the whole unicorny thing and jojo siwa and more into like what's cool um and so i didn't want to get her like a gimmicky lip balm or anything and i thought like in the shape of a diamond was quite cool and grown up i guess um so yeah that'll be just like one of her things that was a pound um i found these which i've been looking for um well, i haven't actually been actively looking for them but i wanted them the little like brown elastic bands for your hair um this is a pack of 500 wow and it was a pound amazing they had clear ones uh these are like the lighter brown ones they also had black um did they have blonde ones i don't know but yeah i really want to try doing like two french braids in my hair and then like um tying them up here and because my hair's short and it's quite like fine um I needed like those little tiny elastic bands rather than like the big hair bands I use to do a bun. Um, so yeah, I got those. I'm really excited to just kind of like play around with my hair. Um, I also found this. Oh, I don't know if I'm ever going to use it for two pounds. It's a big mustard velvet bow. Um, this is attached to a hair band and a clip. So I guess you can like tie the hair up, but then also the clip gives extra support. Um, I'm tempted to maybe cut the hairband off and just have it as a clip. Um, I see myself having my hair like half up, half down, and then like this on, on the back of it or something. Um, 
I just saw it and thought it looked cute. I don't know if I'm ever going to wear it, but we'll see. <laughs> and then um, Adam actually pointed these out for me. Uh, they were one pound, and these are cooling pads in cucumber. There are six pads in here. Um, do not reuse pads. Do not sleep with them on. I have they got something on them, or am I meant to put them in the fridge? I have no idea. Um, I kind of thought they were ones that I could put in the fridge and keep reusing them, but obviously not. Um, yeah, never used them before. Have any of you used them before? I just feel like if I'm having a bit of a pamper, they'll be nice to put on my eyes. Um, and also, hay fever, itchy eyes, red eyes, perfect, hopefully. So they were only a pound, which is amazing. Um, I've got a receipt in there. Oh. Um, okay. Uh, I have another Primark bag. There are a couple of things I can't show you because I bought them for my cousin Charlie for either her birthday or Christmas. Um, which is really early, but I don't really care. Um, I love Marie stuff. Um, my middle name is Marie. My sister Maisie's middle name is Marie. We have this whole Marie thing going on. I always buy pyjamas that have Marie from the Aristocats on. I've got a Marie from the Aristocats teddy on the top of my wardrobe. Um, I've got Marie jewellery holder thing. I've got a Marie coaster. Just, I love Marie. <laughs> Um, and I found this. So there were actually, in the big Primark, loads of pyjamas that had Marie on. Um, but I don't buy the like little vest top and short sets. Um, because with the vest tops, I'd have to get a really big size because I've got rather large boobs. Um, and I feel like as you, the more you wash them, the smaller they get. And I, my boobs would be like, <sighs> so no. Um, and then I don't buy the cropped t-shirt and shorts set either because I don't like the cropped t-shirts um yeah so I feel like I'm kind of hard harder to buy pajamas for but anyway I found this now I'm not really much of a nighty girl I do have one other nighty um like granny granny nighty which has Marie on um and I saw this but I just really liked it um so <laughs> it is like a giant t-shirt it's a nighty with Marie's face all over it but I really liked the ends of the sleeves they're like folded over and they're pink with white polka dots I just really liked that um and I got this they had an XL and a 2XL so an XL was like 18 to 20 um and that is the size I would normally get but I just bought the bigger size and it is big on me um but I kind of love it and who's really gonna see me in my big Marie nighty. Um, yeah, so I got that. I think it was eight pounds. Let me check. Marie jersey, yeah, eight pounds. Um, and I really liked it. So I'm glad I got that. I have been wearing it. I just love it. Love Marie. Um, I also got from Primark two baskets. Um, I've probably shown them in the video at some point maybe like organizing my bathroom or decluttering my bathroom or something um but I have two copper wire baskets that I got from Primark like last year or the year before and I keep my bubble bath and my lush products and bath salts and stuff like that in them and I keep them underneath my bathroom sink um, not in a cupboard they're just like on a shelf underneath the sink and if any water drips down because they're copper and metal um they like get a bit rusty and they've been leaving stains on the white shelf um so I know I needed to swap them so I found these these are white but they're also not metal um however I have just realized it looks like they're metal on the inside um but hopefully that means they don't Hopefully they still don't rust. I don't really know. Um, this is a pack of two and they were seven pounds. So we've got, I'll just rip them open. We've got, oh, they're attached. So we've got this like smaller one and then this bigger one. And I thought they could replace my copper ones and then I could use my copper ones in a different room for something else. Um, so yeah, I got those for my bathroom. Um, I think the last thing is the birthday present yes it is okay and then 
I bought a couple of things from Superdrug and I just thought I'd show you them. Um, one of them is a birthday present, la la la. <laughs> um, I got a new deodorant, how fun. Um, I tend to use the roll-ons more than the sprays, but sometimes you know, when you're really, really sweaty and you just need the spray because it feels so cooling. Um, this is the Mitchum one, I've fallen in love with Mitchum. Um, and this is 48 hour protection in the scent shower fresh. Um, I just bought it because I was in a rush and there were loads of people by the deodorants and no one was like letting me through so I just like reached my arm through and just grabbed anyone. Um, I think the one I am using at the moment is called Flower Fresh I think and that smells really nice. Um, they've got Powder Fresh that I don't really like the smell of, I feel like it's a bit granny-ish. I think, I think I'm saying the right ones but um, this is okay, I probably wouldn't buy the scent again, I need to stick to, I think it's Flower Fresh. Um, I bought a, oh how much was it? It was half price, I know that. I think it was 148. That's not the right receipt, oh no. Yeah, I think it was 148. I bought a new Rimmel Stay Matte Powder. I get this in the shade Transparent and it's just, I've just used this for years and I will continue to use it. Um, I really like it. Um, that's the end of that. <laughs> and then I bought two new lip products. So the first one, they're both by NYX and I really wanted to try just these two products because I'm used to using the soft matte lip creams and they feel really moussey and they feel really nice um, and I wanted to try other like formulas and stuff. So this is the NYX Powder Puff Lippy in the shade Cool Intentions. So it's a powder lip cream. Um, if I get it out, this is what it looks like and it basically has a sponge on the end and you squeeze it and then you rub it all over your lips. Um, I was wearing this in my last video in my review of my July products so go and have a look. I feel like it's very similar to this colour but I feel like the powder puff one is just a bit lighter. Um, I really like the formula of this lipstick. I feel like it feels really nice on my lips. Um, however, because it's a sponge it's really hard to like stay in the lines um so i feel like next time i wear it i will need to wear a lip liner um because i want to get like a sharper line on my lips and if i had this in red or something where it stands out even more yeah i think you just definitely need a lip liner with those um but yeah i feel like it's still really nice and then the lippy that i'm wearing at the moment is a nyx lingerie um, liquid lipstick. This is in the shade French Made. It's number 20 um, and I've got it on now so it's a bit darker. I do actually really like the colour. Um, it When I first put it on and it was in the process of drying it did not feel very nice. I kind of walked around like this like trying to keep my lips apart because if they touched it was like really sticky. Um, now it's dried down it feels a lot more comfortable um, I would definitely like to try like other shades but I'm kind of been into the more like purpley kind of lips at the moment I feel like it looks quite nice um, so yeah there's that NYX lingerie definitely not as light feeling and moussey as the soft matte lip creams but um, I feel like the colours nice and yeah, I'm happy with it, so that's good. Um, I have a worry though that it might start to like peel off in, on, you know, like the middle of your lips. Um, we'll see. <laughs> um, is that everything? I think that might be everything, yeah. Um, there we go, that is everything I bought in the massive Primark, which I loved, and uh, Superdrug when I was in Birmingham. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a like and subscribe if you would like to and I'll see you in a few days in my next video. Bye!